Hello everyone, I'm back again in Marvel Snap, and today what I've got for you today is the craziest hybrid deck, Silver Surfer, Patriot, Dazzler, Ultron, crazy combo deck. Um, it's a whole lot of fun. Uh, before I jump into it, um, if you like the videos and you want to see more, I'd really appreciate it if you could like and subscribe to the channel. So yeah. But without further ado, let me explain how this deck is going to work out. So, the main components here, I really named it, I named it the Ultra Dazzler deck because I want to use, I only recently unlocked Ultron, he's my newest Series 3 unlock. I'm almost Series 3 complete. Um, but I wanted to use Ultron and then the newly buffed Dazzler and I saw someone recently using a Silver Surfer Patriot Dazzler list and I got inspired to add Ultron in there because Ultron just has natural synergy with Dazzler with his ability to fill up the board with drones and Dazzler now gets plus two power for each location that's full on my side. So she can be a potential 3-8 if we fill up the entire board. But there's a lot of different play routes here. Generally, we can go a bunch of 3-drops like Patriot Mystique. Um, a 3-drop Cyclops to get buffed up by those two. And a Brood also for the Broodlings to get buffed up by Patriot. And then we could also throw down a Silver Surfer. But also Brood has good combo with a good combo potential with Dazzler because he's also filling up a location. Um, we got Storm, just another good 3 drop and we're gonna be able to have reach into those locations, the stormed off location with Ultron, so we're not gonna have to worry about it and also we'll still be able to put power into the location with Sur Surfer or Patriot potentially. Um, additionally we just got some basic one drops in here, Ant-Man, because we're you know, we're filling up lanes, so Ant-Man's going to be a 1-4. We like to see it. And Misty Knight, she's just a curve 1-drop we can play with no ability, who's ho hopefully going to get buffed up by Patriot, but al also just a 1-2 is good to play on curve. And Shocker will also be able to play him out on curve. So this is just the idea, like, on turn 4, we're also we're going to want to play a 3-drop. So, like, the dream is kind of like... Maybe Patriot turn three, and then Mystique in a one in one of your one drops turn four, and then another three drop and Shocker turn five, and then either Ultron turn six or two three drops turn six, like Silver Surfer and Wolfsbane or something. Um, I say Wolfsbane probably the most replaceable card, but she's just good because you know we're filling up lanes and she gets more power on reveal. But you could put in maybe like a Shadow King if you wanted a tech option. Shadow King's a fun one. <laughs> But yeah, that pretty much explains the list. It's pretty simple, but it's, it's it's a lot of fun and there's a lot of different, it's got a lot of flexible options. So yeah, I'm gonna just get right into the gameplay. I'll see you guys there. Leela posted up. Look at that kitty. Oh yeah. The best kitty. Fine, we'll just Misty Knight <laughs> into a blind location. Why not? Haha, -ha. you fool. Now, what if I were to storm this? I'm gonna storm it. <laughs> <laughs> Wind aid my hand. Absolutely devious activity. So oh, he's moving. Maybe. Ultron left will be good. It'll two, fill up two lanes. And Dazzler will get to six. So I'm liking Dazzler here. Let 
mirror dimension might turn into flooded. Okay, no, it didn't. Okay, that's actually so bad for me. That's actually so abysmal. Oh, I wasn't looking at mirror dimension. Or, rather, I played Storm without knowing mirror dimension would flip. <laughs> And also just played Dazzler without thinking about that, but there wasn't much other options. Damn, this is tough. Yeah, it's gonna have to be Ultron. Time dolls. If he Heim dolls, he wins left, but then he gets seven mid. But Dazzler's gonna be at six plus seven, so Dazzler's gonna go to eight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, it'll I'll win if he Heim dolls. Heimdall's right. It's a tie, and do I win tiebreaker? I think I think so. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for it. He doesn't play anything. You love to see it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> Oxide Gunner. What the fuck kind of name is that? I like the squirrels. Let's hope he's not running Killmonger. He's not running Killmonger. Go fucking with the Shocker variant. I also have the Steampunk variant, but I got this one. Zabu on two, Nebula on one. Jeez, bro. Calm down. It's not that serious. Oh, Andy gets killed? That's crazy. Hmm. How do I want to go about this? We'll be able to get an eight power dazzler. Give me Okay, we're also gonna get an eight power mystique. Or six power mystique. Shit, maybe I should have Is this the play instead? Let's see, six. This adds 12, so I go to 15 here. Not bad. Dazzler would go up four to 10.
don't like the fact that he's snapping. Three, six, nine. And we go to 12. I do this here. This might be my best bet. I'm going to run it for the content. Infinite. No shot, Bucko. What the hell? Why are you running infinite in this deck? Like what? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> yeah, I wasn't really thinking in that last match. <laughs> but infinite really do be a card that be a doing a thing. Yo, fuck a cord. I'll actually take a rock. I will take a rock. Every day. Who played? He's gonna run Black Widow next, bro. It's just like... Systems go. It's a lot of power. Shocker. Shocker. Cyclops, Silver Surfer. Or is it win all three lands profit? dump cards to make Ronin smaller. He's probably going to Maximus or something, though, so I'll go. Win all three lands profit, baby. Just please don't cheese me, Iron Lad. Nice. Victory. We absolutely cooked. Thanks for protecting my ones, bro. It's very appreciated.
I'm just fucking Professor Xing. Any. That's not Professor X. Okay. I think Cyclops Silver Surfer wins? Let's do it. It's big power. I mean, what's he gonna do against big power? <laughs> Sunspot, you're joking, right, mate? That's a joke, right, mate? <laughs> Nice try. On to the next one. We cooked. So. I haven't really had a chance to use Ultron yet. But. Ooh, I'm gonna fuck with some squirrels. I can hold the shocker actually because he's 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 there to play him on curve. Don't need to do it now. Is, uh, we're looking a little dicey, but maybe we can cook. He's kind of over committing mid. A null will be kind of kind of spooky. Okay. Oh, why can't that just win me mid? God damn it! <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Cyclops. Cyclops goes to eight. Rude's also big. Dazzler's getting big. I'm already winning left. I'm gonna snap on him. Or I mean, I'm already winning right and left, so he has to he has to decide. Let's go, big Dazzlers! Big Dazzler! <laughs> What's that Dazzler diff? Again, didn't need to use the Ultron, but... Yeah, Dazzler. There's actually a very high ranking version of this deck without Ultron with Sarah that's like number two on like best win rate decks or something on uh, untapped.gg. So yeah, this is, if you wanna be using Dazzler, now is the time. <laughs> <laughs> Before she gets nerfed. Just kidding. Don't nerf Dazzler. She's great. And also not in need of a nerf. She's perfect. Alright. This will be the last game. Live from the Daily Bugle.
Fuck it, I'll play a Carnage. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> Venom, but I'm up, I'm up, I'm up. Yeah, I can copy with Mystique next turn. Give the ninja some, give the ninja some power. Give me Shocker. Uh, no Shocker, but it's fine. Okay, this is the Ultron. Oh, it was going to be the Ultron game. <laughs> that was a quick one to end the video, but yeah, as you can see, this deck just, it's all, it always has an answer. There's always something you can play with like its low curve, um, and then there's the surprise Ultron at the end, because for some reason people forget about Ultron, um, but not this guy. This guy was scared. But yeah, I'm going to end the video there. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please hit the like button and subscribe so you don't miss any of my future content. Uh, but yeah, I will see you guys another time. Peace out.